Today is a big day for Missouri Southern football. Southern introduces Atiba Bradley as its next head coach, a pick that means history for MSSU and a homecoming for Bradley. Atiba Bradley made history on Wednesday afternoon. Missouri Southern's new head football coach, Atiba Bradley. Bradley is the first black head coach in Missouri Southern history. I think right now there's, there's five black head coaches in Division II. Uh, I think there's nine in all divisions, and so I don't take these opportunities lightly. You know, this is, this is a big deal um, because, you know, I set the standard for a lot of kids looking up. No different than I looked up to a lot of athletes and coaches, to, you know, Herm Edwards. You know, some of those guys that came before me um, that kind of paved the way for me. It's a homecoming for Bradley. He played for the Lions from 2002 to 2005 before beginning his coaching career at both the Division I and Division II levels. When I was young with no kids, it was fun to travel. It was fun to kind of go to different universities and learn. Um, but now as I get older, my kids are getting older, it's good to have them around friends, family, um, and, and have a little bit of a support net. He had the personal qualities uh, that I think will really uh, build a great culture and a great program here at Missouri Southern. And then, of course, coming home. He has roots here as a, a native of Joplin, a Missouri Southern graduate, a former football player. Bradley takes over a program that did not get on the field last fall and is 5-39 and 39 since 2016. I'm not naive. It's not going to be easy. It's, it, you know, this is a tough league. There's great competition, but you know, I'm excited to be back and, and, and get this thing turned. Now that he's the guy, Bradley aims to help the Lions climb the MIAA, including the Crimson and Gold guys down the road. I think that's the beauty of college athletics, is that we do get to play a team that is 20 minutes down the road. Um, we, you know, we, we see them in recruiting, we see them in the league, we, you know, we see them a lot. And so I'd be lying if I, if I said I didn't want to beat them, you know what I mean? That, that's part of you know, being here at Missouri Southern.